And thanks for joining us. The need for substitute teachers has reached a dire level at the South Vermilion Community School District. Now the district is trying to find new ways to attract applicants. News since Madison Zaleski visited Van Dyne Elementary today. She explains how the school district is taking initiatives to resolve this issue. South Vermillion is in desperate need of substitute teachers for the school year. Melanie Beaver with South Vermillion says the lack of substitute teachers can cause some disruptions for the district. In the 23-24 school year, um, we had over 600 subpositions that went unfilled. That meant we had to cover that within each building, and that was a big challenge for us. The district currently has 125 teachers and only 27 active substitutes within all four of its schools. Beaver says substitute educators play a vital role in maintaining both academic and operational continuity. But with too few substitute teachers available, teachers like Tori Kilgore have to rely on support staff to cover classes. There's days where you feel like maybe there's something that you need to do outside of school, or maybe you're not feeling the best, but a lot of days you just try to come to school and and you know get through the day just because you don't want to make it a burden on anybody else to have to take your room. In hopes to increase the application pool, South Vermillion recently changed its application requirements. We used to have a policy for our subs that you had to have 30 college credit hours and we took that completely away. To attract more substitutes, Beaver says the district also increased the pay rate. If you have no um, college credit hours and you do have your substitute teaching license and complete our South Vermilion training. It's one day of training for eight hours and they are paid for that day of training. They do that on their own. Once they have a substitute teaching license then that's $90 a day, 45 for a half day. Beaver says there are many benefits to substitute teaching. That's as a vast majority of subs have the flexibility to decide when, where, and how often they work. Reporting in South Vermilion, Matt Zaleski, News 10. Now, if you're interested in applying, you can find that information on our website. That's, of course, WTHITV.com.